Hello? Hello? Hello, good evening. Sister. Good evening. How are you, Camilla? I'm going well. All right, doing fine. That's great. That's good. How was uh how was work today? So so light, maybe. I I can I don't work very much today. Oh you didn't work much today. <laughs> All right. That's good. It's a relaxed day today. A relaxing day, yes. Yeah. Well, I'm I'm glad you have a you had a nice day. Yeah, me too. I didn't work much during the day. Only the only this class. I had only a two hour class in the morning. Well, one hour a one hour class in the morning. And uh, that was it. I've been busy with other things okay. instead. Mm -hmm. Yes. Great. So it's good to have you. Let me text your classmates because they have to be here. Yeah. And by the way, <laughs> today we have to run attendance at the beginning, in the middle of the conference, and at the end of the conference. So uh, we will we will run attendance three times today. I mean, from now on. But I will not do it now because it's only you and I. Just wait. So, well, let's start. So uh, today we will we will work with uh, passive voice. Okay, that's what we are working on. We'll uh, work on making sentences with passive voice um, using participles. So that's what we are going to review today. All right, great. Let's see if you remember the participles of uh, some verbs to begin with, okay? Um, what about the participle of uh, begin? Begun, begin, 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 and be begun. Begun, yes. Uh huh. All right, great, great. On its way. All right, good. Do you remember the participle of uh, drink? Drunk. Drunk. Yeah, drunk. Drunk. Yeah, it spells drunk and a and d r u n k and it sounds drunk. Drunk. Very good. Uh, how about, uh, do you remember the particle of the verb uh, take? Taking? Yeah, good. That's the one. How about, how about for the, uh, for the break, uh, for the verb break? Break. break. Broken. Mm-hmm. There you go. There you go. Well done. Yes, that's good. That's good. How about for the verb, uh, for the verb get? Get. Mm -hmm. Get. Get, got, get, getting. Yeah, get, got, gotten. Okay, yeah, that's it. Get, got, gotten. Great, great, very good. Um, great, great, so that's good. So we use, uh, we use these, uh, these types of sentences to, uh, or these structures to make uh, passive voice sentences, all right? So we'll practice uh, some of that today, all right? We'll practice mm -hmm. some of that today and I will show you some uh, examples too, some uh, structures, all right? 
and uh, let us uh, let us just uh, wait for a couple of minutes more. I mean, this is so this is weird. I don't know why why you're not here. What day? Today is the first, right? Yes, first. Mm -hmm, yeah. September mm -hmm. first. Okay, so that might be a reason. That might be a reason. Well, but it's not okay yet. It's really not okay. Uh, yeah, I don't know what. Uh, okay, I don't know why. It's it's really weird that they're not here. Okay, great. Um. So let us just wait for them just for a couple of minutes more. I just texted them. Just, just a second here. Okay, great. So, well, we'll begin making um, making some sentences. I will show you. I'm gonna show you some pictures, and uh, I want to see if you can handle it. If you can make uh, sentences with uh, these uh, with these uh, pictures, uh, we're gonna use passive voice. Okay. So here are some pictures let's see if you can if you remember how to use it just i'm just testing over here look at this hello mary oh that's three people hi, hi, hi. that's awesome <laughs> wow how are you doing how are you doing they are uh, cleaning the house uh, okay no, but but how about the room now? Good, that's great. They're cleaning the house. They're cleaning the room. That's fine. But let's now change perspective. Let's now focus on the room instead of the of, instead of them instead of uh, the people. So, uh, what is it? What what is happening to the room? The room. The room is the room had cleaning for day. Uh, uh, okay, oh. we're closed. Actually, oh, yeah. sorry. L let's have a uh, Mary. Mary, what do you think? What do you think about this? What's happening to the room? Mary. What is happening to the room? Maybe the room has been cleaning. Okay, yeah, we're getting close. We are getting so close, like it. So yeah, the room is being cleaned. Okay, so we use passive voice when to when uh, when we want to focus rather on uh, on the on the receiver of the action instead of the doer so the subject of the sentence is not 
anymore the one the the most important one now the most important uh of the sentence or the subject of the sentence is now the object so we kind of uh change the perspective here so it's not like uh, they are cleaning the room but we say the room is being cleaned so that's the little uh change of perspective we do let me uh let me just uh write it down here jot it down so we say the room is being cleaned there you go the room is being cleaned so look we use the verb be all right the verb be i'm sorry mm -hmm. i'm sorry teacher yes i have a problem what, with the what? internet uh no problem mary that's okay 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 probably the connection will be better later yes so so yeah we we go like this the room is being cleaned and uh, we use uh we use the subject you know the 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 object becomes a subject we use the verb be plus participle okay this is this is in the in like in the present continuous but we'll we will see more examples in other verb forms as well okay so so uh let's let's go ahead let's pay attention and have more practice on this all right let me just uh open the student's manual there we have um, we have uh, more examples of this so we can see them and uh, and practice more All right, so we'll practice uh, present perfect with passive voice, all right? Or the use of passive voice with present perfect. So please, um, Mary, uh, can, you read the, can you read the heading of this table and the examples as well, please? Okay. The passive voice mm -hmm. is used when the emphasis of the sentence is on the action and not on the subject. Mm -hmm. Great, great. So uh, please read the examples. Okay, number one. Mm -hmm. Your Google's Google's. Yeah, goggles in this case. Goggles, uh, goggles have been taken away. Mm -hmm. In contrast to one B, they have taken your Google's your away. Goggles. Yeah, your goggles. Google Mm -hmm. so, all right good good continue reading please in a sentence number one a the person who took away the google, google <laughs> i'm sorry <laughs> the goggles goggles is not important the fact that they were taken away in is instead in in facet Emphasize, yeah, it is emphasize. Emphasize. Okay, great, great, very good, very good. Now, uh, please, Camilla, continue. Okay, the passive voice stain, statements of that plus how has me plus mm -hmm. verb plus participle form. All right. Okay. The second one. Have have my safety Google. Uh, being stolen in contrast to have they stolen my safety goggles safety right yeah safety mm -hmm. the question focus is a safety google goggles mm -hmm. not is a person who has stolen them all right okay so it's not uh the question is not about the people but it's rather uh about the it's rather about the the object, right? Have my safety go uh, goggles been stolen? They say, or have they stolen my safety goggles? All right. So, 
uh, now we look at the form. This is important. This is very important. Look, now passive, uh, passive voice statement. The structure goes like this. We begin with the object. We continue with the form of uh, have or has been, you know, like this. B E E N has been, uh, plus the verb in past participle form, right? The verb in past participle form. So, I I was uh, reviewing uh, participles with Camilla, and I hope that uh, Mary you remember them and that your classmates do remember them as well, because uh, we we will use them a lot today it's very important that we remember the participles it's essential all right so look at the look at these uh, look at these uh, examples and uh, this is how you figure how you make a passive voice sentence all right let's do a little practice i was i was doing this a uh, little practice with with camilla and let's do it now how about how about now there uh how about the this sentence about the room let's they not uh-huh yes please they have been um cleaning uh okay what about uh if we focus on the room so the room the room has the room has been mm -hmm. Uh, cleaned. 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 Yes, the room has been cleaned. Very good. And uh, what about? Look at this. Look at this. Uh, look at what the man is doing, or look at what's happening to the wall instead. What's happening to the wall, or or what happened? What has happened to the wall instead? He or they had been painting. All right. Well, okay, good. Yeah, he's been painting it. But now we will not focus on him. We'll focus on the wall. Get my, do you get my point? So we'll not focus on the person, but we'll rather focus on the, on the action, on the object. So we'll say something like the wall, past participle, the, wor uh, the wall, what should... yes yes good good the wall has been what painted painted yes with an ed right the wall has been painted very good so the wall has been painted all right painted what it's been painted what color white 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 very good Hey, look at this, uh, look at this, uh, this one. What about now? What about now? What can you tell me about this? Let's not focus on the man. Let's focus on the house. The window of the roof has been repaired. Re okay. okay. That's or, a point. That can be one. Yeah, I guess. Any other? Any other suggestion? Uh, the house has been con. Mm. Getting there. Getting there. Getting there. Getting there. Has been the house has been. No, you're getting um, there. Yeah. I don't know how do you say um, um, repair, no repair, it's con constru I don't know. Uh, uh, okay. Build. 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 Yeah, good. Yeah. Good. Build. And uh, let's, let's, uh, let's go ahead and, and write down participles. So we go like build, build. Build. Okay, this is the participle built, and the participle is built. Mm -hmm. Thank you. Great. Hey, next one. Next one. Let's see the next picture. So we're just uh, 
we're just not looking at these ones. All right, great. And uh, what about uh, what about this one? Oh, look at this. This one first. So the car. The car has been repaired. All right, the car has been repaired. Yeah. Oh. Or is it repaired now? Is it finished? No. Uh huh. Fixed. Has been fixed. Okay. Yeah, we we can use we can say that, but logically, probably it's not being repaired yet. Not being repaired yet. Look, I mean, it's being repaired now. But what happened to it? Just take a guess. What do you think happened to the car? Do you think that the temperature is not working? Yes. The yes. Battery? Okay. All right. Uh, so probably the car has been broken, you say, right? The car has been broken, right? The car has been broken. Like okay. when, when something is not working, we say, oh, it's broken. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Right? It's broken. Broken. Or my car broke. Oh, that means that your car, you know, you're having trouble with your car. Great. All right, let's 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 keep looking at more examples. How about this one? All right, good. Oopsie. So what about this one? Please tell me, the man or the wallet? Anybody? The girl. Yeah. Oh. The, the wallet has <laughs> been stolen. Okay, get the wallet. Ha the the wallet has been stolen. Yeah. The wallet. Yeah, and uh, or the man is being the man is being stolen. The man is being. Uh, we use this this word like uh, robbery. Rob. All right. Yeah, you're close. You're close. How about in past? How do you put that in in a in verb form in the past? Like this, okay? The man has been the man has been robbed. Uh, the man has been robbed. Like for example, oops, I was robbed, All right? Or I was uh I was mugged, but he didn't notice when this happened. That's that's one thing, right? He's been he's been uh he's been robbed, but he didn't notice when 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 he was robbed. Okay, great, great. Let's keep making sentences over here. How about this one? The model. Um yeah, the model the the model has Let's see who who else is in here. Jonathan, welcome. Arabella, welcome too. So, how about the model? What what's happened to her? Has been uh, oh, take a, uh, took taking took a, a pictures. Taking a picture. Yes. Uh, we can also use the verb photograph. So the woman has been. Or the model has been session the the photograph. Uh -huh. Oh no! Uh, has been taken a uh, photograph session probably. Uh huh. But uh, mm -hmm. or the woman the model has been. Let's use the verb photograph. Okay, let's use the verb photograph. The woman has been, and let's use in the in in the past participle. Okay, the woman has been, or the model has been. 
what's uh let we have we're gonna use this verb i'm gonna give you a clue and let's please use it so this is your this is your clue photograph photograph can also be a verb so let's use it as a verb so the woman has been or the model has been if we want to make this a participle what do we do ed oh yes no. yes yeah good so the woman has been photographed it. all right yeah the woman has been photographed photograph Photograph. Uh, photographed. Good, good. All right, we're getting there. All right, let's do a little review on uh, on uh, on the structure of uh, passive voice. I was uh, I was uh, telling Maria and uh, and Camilla a little uh, a little earlier that um, <clears throat> that uh, we form the passive voice when we change the emphasis of the sentence and the, the emphasis of the sentence is no longer is no longer in the person but it is on the action so i don't pay attention to the person who does the action but i rather pay attention to the action and to whom the action is being done uh, for example we have your goggles have been taken away all right and now you compare this to they have taken your goggles away this is active on the right or letter b is active and uh, letter a is rather passive you see you see my point so that's a big difference all right that's the big difference between the two of them one is active and one is rather passive okay and uh uh and uh, now we we're gonna i'm gonna ask uh, i'm gonna ask uh jonathan and romulo and Nagabella to make some sentences for example i have uh, this bottle and i uh and i do and i do this okay so make a sentence before i drop the water on the computer make a sentence please what has what has happened what has happened uh what has happened to the bottle um, Jonathan, Romulo, Arabella. Ball has been handled by the teacher. Okay, that can be one. Thank you. Good job, Romulo. I did this. I took the. I took. I took the the lid off. Okay. What can you say? So what can you say, Jonathan, Arabella? The maybe the teacher has seen mm -hmm. has seen the water, the what the bottle of water. Uh, what if what if you change the subject of the sentence? It's not the teacher anymore. Now it's the bottle. Okay. Mm -hmm. The bottle cap have been taken away. <laughs> the bottle cap has been, yeah. The bottle cap has been taken away. Great, Murray. Great. So we changed, all right, I've got a couple of texts in here. We changed the focus of the, all right, the bottle is being open. Okay. All right, the bottle has been open, present perfect. 
all right? The bottle has been opened. That's what I did. I opened the bottle, all right? All right, good. So now let's go ahead and, uh, and uh, continue with, uh, with more practice. All right, uh, I was asking the guys, I was asking the guys to look, look at, look at this also, of, uh, how you make questions. Look at this and how you make questions with the passive voice in present perfect. Teacher, uh, the, the, the sentence that the bottle has been opened. Mm -hmm, exactly. It has to have ED, it has to yeah? the ED because it's the participle of the verb. Yes, exactly. It has to be opened because opened. you add ED to the verb. You know, it's, it's uh, the past participle. All right, great. Thank you, Ramul. That's a good point. Remember past participle of the verb form. If you don't remember past participles, mm, we're in a little trouble. So you still have to review them. Okay, it's not like it's the end. It's not the end of the world, but it will be a little more difficult to use passive voice if you don't remember the participles so please study them study passive uh, study participles if you don't remember them now okay great oh text just receive the text your daughter okay this is the present perfect all right daughter all right great so uh let's continue oh yeah questions questions look as in any other regular yes or no question, I change the order of the elements. How so? Easy. Let's read the structure. This is a sentence, right? This is a sentence. What goes first on a sentence, Jonathan? The object. The object. Continue. What's next, please? Has been. Okay. Oh, has been. Yeah. And what's next? The bear. It's in past participle. In Fun. past participle, it's a verb. Very good. So that's that's a sentence. Now let's look at a question. What's the structure of a question? Um, What's the structure of a question, Arabella? Can you read it, please? Hello? Are you there? Mm, Murray, can you please? Question. Read this read the structure of a question. Have or has mm -hmm. plus object plus the plus our uh, bird past particle. Okay, Four. so let's try some examples. All right, look at this one. Let's read this example. Have my safety goggles been stolen? She says, like, oh, have myself, my, have my safety goggles been stolen? I can see them. Have you been working? Yeah, this is the present perfect. But now remember that we are changing the, the perspective. Like, for example, in the news, uh, we'll, we'll go over that later, all right? We're changing perspective. And look at this. The, the order of the elements, the order of the elements is different. Look, 
here we say uh, object like my my goggles have been stolen because I know my goggles have been stolen. Where are they? But then look at this. Have my goggles been stolen? I'm not sure whether that has actually happened. It's a question. So in a question, we change the order of the elements. What goes first in a question, Arabella? Excuse me, I don't understand. Sorry, what goes first on a question? Uh, this, this, this question, have you have been working? No, uh, look at the screen, please. Ah, very good. Ah, okay. Okay, you <coughs> have this second or first. Uh, have, have my safety Google mm -hmm. being stolen. Yeah, what goes first in there? What's the first word? It's the auxiliary. Ah, yes. <laughs> the auxiliary. It's, it's auxiliary. The auxiliary has. What goes next? Uh, object is safe. Uh, object is, is, is my safe, safety. Safety goggles. All right. Safety goggles. Mm -hmm. All right, good. Okay. So, um, so now, uh, have been what? We use the verb been, been and then the verb in what form? So, a verb in past. In past participle. So we ask. Participle. Yeah, have form. my goggles been stolen? Okay, now uh, let's try to make some sentences with these pictures. All right, let's try to make sentences with these pictures. I mean, sentences and or questions. So please, I'm gonna ask first. First, I'm gonna ask uh, Camilla to make a question about this picture and ask any of your classmates. Any of your classmates can answer your question. Okay, Ramulo. Have, has, have, the, have nails been... Okay. All right, have the nails been... What? Oh, here, the, what? Has, Sorry. The nails has been painted. No. Uh, have, have, have the nails mm -hmm. been painted? All right. And you have to answer to her. Have they or they haven't? I mean, yes or no? What's your answer to that? What's your answer to that? Do they have been? Uh, Jonathan has to answer. You make a, you made a good question. Jonathan has to answer. Yes, they have or no, they haven't. Yes, yes they have. Mm -hmm. uh, all right. Is this a nail being painted? Yeah, have the, nails been, have the nails been painted? Well, we actually we actually don't use uh, that paint for nails. We don't use the verb paint for nails. We can use the verb polish. Polish. Mm -hmm. We use the verb polish or uh, done or do. Like, for example, well, I'm doing my, uh, some women say, I'm doing my nails. I'm doing my nails. They are, it, that means that they are polishing them. So you can, uh, you can say polish or do. 
which uh, in the in the this material or this uh thing this uh this thing that the woman is using for polishing her nails is called nail polisher all right so that thing that the woman is doing is called nail polisher all right Great. Teacher, so so the correct uh, uh, question is um, how the how the nails being done. Great. Yes, that's it. When it comes to structure, your your question was okay. The structure was okay, just the vocabulary. But now it's good. Now it's perfect. Now it's perfect. Okay. Great. Can can you? the question sure absolutely have Thank you. the nails been polished or done yeah have the nails been polished or done hmm great great I will show you just a few more of these uh, pictures and you guys make sentences all right all right good let's take another look at a different one yes i don't know that all right good a question out of it Yes, eh, allí eh, es, bueno, yo veo que es tercera persona porque es una mujer, vea. Entonces, eh, eh, has she been? Eh, no. No, eh, we are referring to the nails, not to her. You see my point? No nos estamos refiriendo a la mujer, nos estamos refiriendo a sus, a sus uñas. Ah, entonces, mm, ok, very good, ok. Mm -hmm. yeah. That, that's why, that's why. All right, good. Let's move on. Let's move on. All right, let's check out another example. Ok. Let's erase all the drawings. Ok. Great. Now, look at this. Question, please. Let's make a question. Uh, now, Romulo, it's your turn to make a question. Microphone, Romulo. You Sounds off. Mute. Uh -huh. Sometimes. Has window has window been cleaned? Has the window the window been cleaned? Okay, that's that sounds good. That sounds good. All right. Uh, who are you asking, please? Repeat, teacher. Sorry. Who are you asking? Uh, select a classmate. Ah. Oh. Answer for you. Okay. Let me have Omar. Welcome. Is he is he back? Yay. Yeah. Omar is, Omar is in the house. Cool. So hello. Has yes. the window been good clean? evening? Hello, Omar. Hello, Romulo. Where are you <laughs> going? All right, cool, cool. Very good. Now uh I guess uh let's we're gonna have Aravela asking a question with the next picture. How about, mm, probably not this one. We'll select some a little different. Okay. Yeah, this. Um, so you make a question. Um, Ver, 
Yeah, you still there? Yes. Has the construction machine. Uh, let's focus on the building, please. The building uh, has been destroyed. The built backwards backwards has luego next is the subject has they mm -hmm. has subject i mean the object of the sentence has has <sighs> Has um, the, ma the machine? No, not the machine. Not the object, machine. Object of the sentence. The not built. The this building. Is the, build. the building. The building. That the building. The mm -hmm. building. Uh, have the building uh, destroyed? Has the building been uh, demolished? Okay. Ah, demolished. Yeah, I guess I guess that, that's what's happening. Or they also say use uh use uh another verb for that. Uh, bulldozed. You know they they call these machines bulldozers, right? Just a little vocabulary here. <laughs> yeah. Who are who are you asking? Who are you asking? I can um, uh, Omar. So, yeah, so Omar, Omar. what do you think? Uh, make a question about this picture. No, no, you answer her question. Ah, okay. Uh, repeat again your question. Arbella, can you repeat your question? Hello, Arabella. <laughs> yes. Um, ha, has the building mm -hmm. ha, has the building more been been mm -hmm. more more large? No, no. Uh, you can say bulldozed or demolished. Mm -hmm. You can say bulldozed. Or demolished. Boulders. <laughs> um, ah, okay, okay, okay. Demolished. Mm -hmm. So, uh, Omar, what's the answer? Uh, okay. The answer will be um, yes, a day they. they uh, has been demolished their building. Right, the building has been demolished. Yeah, look at it. It's all broken. It's just a bunch of iron bars and 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 and, and broken walls. All right, great. Uh, now we will we are we're going to continue with somebody else. Now, Omar, uh, let's use the passive voice structure for making uh, sentences, okay? And the uh, questions. Okay. All right. Great. Now uh, we will look at some more. All right. For example, we have this or this one. So. We're we're not gonna focus on the squirrel, but we're gonna focus on the nut she's eating. So now, can you make a question about the nut? Okay. Uh, using uh, uh, the perfect. Uh, yeah, passive voice in present perfect. Present perfect. Okay. Um, what uh, has or what? just yes or no? 
without you know don't don't use what where how just ah, okay yes or okay no. have okay. or has you know okay the uh is that the <laughs> squirrel but but you're gonna you're gonna make a question omar you know you, you have to start with have or has okay pero cómo se usa ardilla para colocar la palabra ardilla dentro de la de la pregunta? You don't have to use it now. <laughs> no la voy a usar hoy. Okay. Después le digo. <laughs> okay. Um, uh, I don't know, teacher. Uh, I don't, don't know what. Don't know. Okay. All right. Yeah. Probably. Probably. All right. Let Let me give you a hand. Let's ask. Uh, you need help? Select somebody. Yes, I, I need help, teacher, but I don't. But I, <laughs> I can do this. Yeah, <laughs> probably not now because yeah, this is this is not you know it, you have to review it first. Don't worry, Omar. Uh, so, okay. Uh, ask yeah. me, Jonathan. Jonathan is gonna help you. Okay, so Jonathan, uh, can you help Omar making a question about the nut? Yes. Uh, Maybe it says, uh, have, has the new, ha, has the, the nut. new thing, the nut. Yeah, good, good. Has the nut been eating? All right, has, has the nut been eaten? eaten. Yeah. Eaten. Eaten. Yeah, it has, that, that's good. Mm -hmm. So that's, that's how it goes. Has the nut been eaten? So uh, what we're doing, and uh, for those who just made it, uh, what we're doing is uh, making questions. For in, in this activity, we're just making questions. Uh, we are using passive voice. We don't focus on the doer of the action. And in this case, the doer of the action, uh, the one performing the action is the squirrel. But we will not we will not focus on the squirrel. We'll focus on the nut because it's the receiver of the action. So mm. the nut is being eaten or the nut is being cracked, like when you crack nuts in the in the nutcracker. So the nut is being cracked. It's like when you hear when you hear on the news two men were killed two men were killed in soyapango yeah mm -hmm. two men were killed they don't say uh gang members killed two men no because we don't know if if it was gang men uh gang members we don't know if it was uh drug dealers we don't know if it was the police so when you don't know who the who the doer of the action is you use passive voice or when you want to change the perspective, you don't want to see it from the doer's point of view, but you want to see it from the, from the object's point of view. So when you change, uh, the, change the perspective of it, you use passive voice. So you say, two men were killed, not, uh, not uh, gang members or the police killed two men. You know, will you change the perspective? Or, for example, this. Let's take a look at, uh, at another picture. Um, blah, 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 blah. Whoa, how, how about this? Okay, we will not focus on her, on the thief. No, we won't, which is a woman, by the way. We will not focus on the woman. We'll focus on what's being stolen we'll focus on the wallet all right so what what's happened to the wallet uh Arabella? it's stolen um, all right good good the wallet <laughs> the wallet has been has been stolen. the wallet has been it's stolen yeah the wallet has been stolen all right good okay. And the, the man will later ask himself, gee, 
Has my wallet been stolen? All right. So that is what may happen. Okay. So we change the perspective. We don't say, oh, a woman stole. I mean, in, in active, in active, we say a woman stole his wallet. Oh, we change the perspective. The wallet has been stolen. All right. So yeah. Now, how about this? Do we focus on the on the woman or on the horse? On the horse because uh -huh. it receives action. Yes, the horse receives the action. So, how does our sentence go? Not question. Watch it. Sentence. So, in a sentence, you start with a with the object all right so the horse aleda can you start please can you make a sentence about the horse please um the horse has been ridden ridden yes ridden. yeah that, that that's okay i i knew i knew you meant ridden don't worry so yeah that's it right road and ridden okay the horse, uh, the horse has been, the horse has been ridden. The horse has been ridden. Okay. Hmm. Great. That's good. That's good. Uh, well, now let's see if, uh, well, looks like uh, she can handle it now. Let's see if Omar can. All right. Great, uh, now let's go back to Omar. I just wanna make sure that whoever got late can use this now. So Omar, what about the car? Tell us about the car. Uh, question or sentence? Make a sentence, please. Okay. Or you can make a question too, however. Mm -hmm. Make a sentence. Okay. The car has a fix, has fixed uh with the woman with the with the man mm, the car the car has, has big been has been fixing, uh, fixing the car has been, has been fixed. Fixing. Fixed. Uh, okay okay That's it. you can you can omit the the object it's okay to omit or skip or okay. not use the uh, not uh, the the doer and in this case the the sentence don't uh, finish with a uh, uh, e, e, e n g not necessarily no mm -hmm. sorry when using being mm -mm. no no it doesn't uh, okay. it it may end in the participle you say you said you said the car has been fixed Okay. Fixed. So you finished on the participle. Mm -hmm. You may possibly, if necessary, add the doer of the action, like the car has been fixed by, by, who's this man? The car has been fixed by, by the and, mechanic. Yeah, mechanic. by the mechanic. Now, we know that usually a mechanic fixes the car, fixes cars. So we don't really have to use by the mechanic. That is optional. Using the doer of, an, of, a, of, the, sen, of the action in passive voice is optional. All right? Keep that in All mind. Right. Let me run attendance. And guys, uh, just a little reminder to everyone, and uh, and uh, I will also uh, tell everyone in the chat. In the, is this, uh, Insaforb is now running attendance at the beginning of the session, in the middle of the session, and at the end of the session. So. Please uh, make sure you're on time. Please do. This is the last week. You know what? That it, today's uh, we are in the last week. 
And that's why it's, it's even more important than the other weeks. So please be on time because uh, we have to record attendance. Uh, we have to record attendance three times already. And uh, also uh, late minutes are being recorded. So if if uh, you you come late, your minutes are being recorded. And if you exit minutes, you may lose your scholarship. Okay. Okay. Watch it. Si, si digamos si se han excedido demasiado de minutos, que yo creo que son como son como 500 o 600 algo así, ¿verdad? Porque son las dos horas son cuánto. 90 minutos, ¿verdad? O 120 minutos. 120. Ajá, 120. So, si se han excedido como de los 700, 800, algo así, que equivale como a cuatro clases, hay posibilidades de que no le concedan la beca el próximo. Así que tienen que cuidar los minutos también. Yeah, be, you, you be careful. All right. Where were we? Yeah, over here. Right. Oh, let, let's, all right. Welcome. So, let's read... Uh, let's read... Uh, Let's let's uh, run attendance. So, Jose Enrique de la O Salazar, no está. Katia Maria Soriano, no asiste. Uh, Gladys Aminta Galdames Merino, tampoco. Ana Grisela Hernández, tampoco. Romulo Pompilio, Romul, uh, Romero Torres. Sí. Present, sorry about that. Uh, Iris Dorotea Sánchez Figueroa Acevedo, no está ahorita. Iris. No, that's not it. Uh, Claudia Evelyn Hernandez. No, okay, good. La que estás haciendo. All right. Uh, Maria Belén Quintanilla Barquero. Present. Okay. Thank you. Back. All right. Cesar Romero, Cesar Vladimir Romero no asiste. Omar Inmer Gámez Linares. And yes, he's here. Okay, thank you. Eh, continuamos con Ana Lilia, Ana Lilian González de Peraza. Ana Lilian. Present teacher. Thank you. Wow, you made it. Yes, I'm fly. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I'm, I can I, I can I see. Uber teacher. Say again. I pay Uber. You you took an Uber. Yes, that's okay. great. I'm, I'm glad you're made. Well, thank you yeah. for the sacrifice you're making. All right. For waiting to. Yeah. Thanks. All right, Shane. It's very complicated, believe me. <laughs> yes, I imagine. Where do you live? I live in San Jacinto and I work in La Colonia Escalón. Uh, wow, that's a long ride. It's a long, very, very long. Uh huh. Mm -hmm. That's why, teacher, I'm coming like a. Like a Trueno, thunder. Like thunder. Uh-huh, exactly. Like thunder, yeah. Yes, yes, it is. All right, well, thank God you made it. All right, uh, Arabella, Arabella Parada Gamba. Present teacher. Thank you. Mario Enrique Marquez Celaya. Okay. Gloria Beatriz Elias Alegría Orellana, no está. Adolfo Jonathan Rodriguez Parada. Jonathan, Jonathan, I, I think it was present, so. Elia Samuel Oriana, no asiste. Aleida Elizabeth Juarez de Guevara. Present. Got you. Uh, Andrea Elizabeth Sigüenza Mejia. Andrea. Camila Calles Minero. Present. Thank you. Wow. It's weird that Andrea is not here. Yeah, she's always on time. Well, anyways, anyways, guys, uh, let, let's continue. So we were making, uh, we were making sentences. Yeah, but we will move on and do something a little different. We're going to work, we're going to work in, uh, in small groups. And there are some sentences from the manual that I want you to do, okay? So, um, 
so we are going to we're going to make some questions and sentences using the ideas on uh, using the ideas on your on your students manual all right so uh please uh please uh look at the picture i'm just about to send to your uh to your uh to your group all right i'll put that in just a minute so you can uh so you can go ahead and make your own sentences and questions all right there are some ideas over here so let's go ahead and use them all right it's been sent to your group now uh let's go ahead and 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 uh and work in small groups and use the ideas in there first let me show you how it how it will work so what you're going to do is this this is what you have in your group <clears throat> so what you're going to do is this uh i'm present teacher sorry <laughs> uh, okay, but but I marked you as present. Yo lo marqué siempre, aunque no lo vi, pero me imaginé que maybe it was a you had an issue, you had a problem. Anyways, all right. So uh, now now that you're here, Jonathan, can you read the instruction, please? Okay, uh, complete the follow sentences and question in the passive voice. Choose mm -hmm. the appropriate verbs. Compare answers with a partners mm -hmm. all right good good very good so we're making sentences uh with passive voice and we'll compare our answers with uh with our small group all right great so now let's go ahead and uh, get together it will work in uh in uh in uh in pairs or trios all right so let's go ahead and work in pairs all right pairs will be fine just fine there we go please accept your invitation remember you're working with only one person so please make sure you join that person all right make sure you are together because you will have no one else to work with. All right, everybody's in a group. Okay. Uh, let's see. Are you sharing your 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 screen for me, or or the teachers uh, share the? No, I'm the, not. The I'm not. I think <laughs> this is her. Okay. <laughs> okay. Let's work then, Alida. Alida, uh -huh. <laughs> let's work. Complete the following sentence and question in the passive voice. Choose the appropriate words, compare answer with a partner. Three new safety measures. Mm. Tres nuevas medidas de seguridad. Y no ve a hacer. 
Okay, I think the better the better bird uh, in this case. Uh, uh, I choose create. I don't know what are you what are you thinking I like that. That's good. Cool. Uh, I don't understand. No sé, yo elegí crear, <risa> crear en esta ocasión. No sé si está bien para ti esa. Ocupar el verbo crear en esta primera oración. Todavía no he entendido qué es lo que vamos a hacer. Ah, sí, que vamos a hacer unas oraciones usando la, la, la voz pasiva. Ajá. Sí. Entonces eso es lo que vamos a hacer. Por ejemplo, la primera, hora, la primera frase es eh, tres nuevas medidas de seguridad. Si lo queremos poner en voz pasiva, creo que sería de eh, we, we, ha, we have been create three new safety measures. That's, that's good. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Eso. Sí. Tú puedes digitar ahí. I'll go check on the other group, all right? But yeah, all that's right. what you're doing. Just making sentences and make sure you're using the passive form. All right? Good luck. Okay. Keep it up, guys. The three the user has been trained. What number? The one. Training. 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 Train it. Train it. Okay. Has been trained. Let's see if <laughs> we use another verb. You create. Been. All right, yeah, you continue. Make. Made. Made. Okay, remember, it's a parsable, right? Yes, uh-huh. Uh -huh. Well, uh, I think uh, probably, uh, probably. Um, make. Make. What do you do with safety measures? He hasn't got a safety measures. Let's make some sense. Martin can de hallar el sentido, right? ¿Qué hacen con las safety measures? You train, no, no, make them, no, no. give them, you create them. Given. Aha, uh -huh. all right. Given, aha. Uh -huh. Yes, all right, good. Like it, thank you guys. All right, yeah, keep going. I like it very much, very, very much. Okay, okay. No. it's gonna rain. Look at that, it's gonna rain real hard. We, we, all right, good. Okay, okay, uh, okay. okay. The, By the, the, field, the last, voy a compartir quizá la, ahorita voy. The last is, okay, ahí voy. Aquí está, yes. Then, eh, uh, issue it has been having the new hallmarks. Issue, um, issue. Issue, issue, I don't know, but the, the third, the three new selfie measures have been have been drained and drained. 
Voy a apuntar lo que ya dijimos. Uh -huh. Has been eh, is, uh, trained. Ajá, uh -huh. I, I, I think so, but I don't know. Bueno, pongámosle y luego vemos si, si queda bien. Veámoslas todas y luego vemos si quedan. Sí, si la tenemos que cambiar. Uh -huh. Ok. Eh, eh, the new self safety Google are nice. They eh, they have been they have been innovated. Innovate. No better. No better. No bar. Uh -huh. They have been innovated. Make three new safety measures has been new safety measured has has been mm. uh, have been made maybe uh yeah yes yeah, right okay maybe made let's try to <laughs> okay in the other the, the teacher is is watching. Uh, yeah, I'm just listening. Uh, uh, you keep I going. <laughs> I did. I feel something is looking to me. <laughs> <laughs> okay, in the number two. Number we, two. We innovate. No. We yeah. Have to innovate, maybe. Uh, let's see. Oh, we have to create huh? a new ears. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. We new air plugs, plug, plugs. Next one. Mm -hmm. Short, not small, short. We. Let's. Uh, I am confused. A little confused in this. In With this. Which one? We have. Okay. We have. Uh huh. We have. we have been we have been um create maybe created uh -huh, create uh -huh. oh, we have been let me see we have been mm, no it's a question right is, is it number is it number uh is it number six no, no, number two, teacher. teacher. Number two. We're talking too much. <laughs> we have, uh, oh, yeah. Okay, yeah, we don't have, worry. We have been, new ear we have been created new earplugs, teacher? No. We have created or made, probably, yeah, that, that can help. This is como que tiene sentido. We have made. Oh, Me. no. Acuérdese, uh, acuérdese que tiene que ser en, en pasado, ¿verdad? En, en, en pasivo. Entonces, we have been uh, given, for example, or uh, we have been see, for example, given or innovated, innovated, for example. No, mm, no, 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 no. Probably innovated is not the word. Mm. Created. Created. Uh huh. Created no. new earplugs. Mm hmm. Yeah, that can work. That can I work. Just can find be. what makes more sense okay yeah just find whatever makes more sense but to me probably given is what makes more sense in that one right mm -hmm. that one let's see or issue could work too either way is fine yeah Como issued es como cuando les tramitan, ¿verdad? Que les van a, que les van a dar. Mm. So, so you can use that. All right. Issue, issue tiene varias, uh, sí, porque es, es un problema también, Batiche. Ajá, but, pero cuando es como un verbo, significa algo así como tramitar. O como, ah, o como, es que yo issue, yo lo tenía como una, como una, como cuando dicen, ah, te, te pusieron un issue. 
o una inconsistencia o algo así. No, Ajá, no. Bye, también, pero, ¿verdad? Sí, pero como verbo, eh, uh -huh. eso significa como, como gestionar. O como, podría, porque si ponemos we have been issue issue new new earplugs earplugs, earplugs. Yeah. Ajá, son como los que se ponen en las construcciones ¿verdad? para que no se les dañen los oídos mm, and, uh -huh. ah, okay. in this case I think it's, it's work the issue mm -hmm. good It, uh -huh. issue or given también pero... Ajá, cualquiera de los dos I think the bolt is worth this Ajá. yeah good keep it up guys I'll go check on another group Okay. Uh -huh. Aha, Romulo, what do you choice? Issue or? <laughs> issue. 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 Is fine. Okay. It was the. How are you doing, guys? How are you guys doing? Eh, hemos repartido las oraciones. Ah, We para have vamos made, a, uh, a I think a that one one has a, a system activo. Oh, oh no, no, number two is an active voice. It's got to be in passive voice. It didn't get in passive voice. Yeah. <laughs> uh, uh -huh. Tiene que ser así como New safety uh, I mean We have been Y luego el verbo En, en participio All right, you keep going. We have been made new earplugs. Mm. All right, have you ever created three new safety measures? Yeah. See the new steel tube, steel toe boots. Uh, quizás aquí, mira. Uh, I think made probably is not the one. Quizás made. No es, el, no, es el, no es el verbo para ese. Definitely not. Just, just giving a clue, but made is not the verb. Um, issue, issue, I think. Uh -huh. uh, Tiene más sentido ese, issue than the dos. But issue is like when yes, somebody, uh, is like when somebody uh, makes arrangements For you to get something like como que gestionen para que usted le, le den algo verdad así funciona el verbo issue mm -hmm. y yo creo que tiene mucho sentido en la manera que lo están utilizando ahí yeah. yes. mm -hmm. Later change. Yeah. issue okay. yeah issue vamos a ver los demás grupos okay thank you guys keep it up mm -hmm. you guys how you doing Hello. You finished. You finished. finished. That's great. That's great. We have, been, we, have, we have been finished. You have finished. All right. The exercises have been finished. Wow. Isn't it raining like real, real hard where you where you live? Yes. Wow. Over here is like strong winds and and the and the pouring 
like raining real, real, real hard. There, I had to. If I, I had to close the windows because it, there was there was too mu uh, too much noise in here, so it was it was very uncomfortable. <clears throat> okay. Yes. So uh, yeah, you guys finished then, huh? Yes. 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 All right. All right. Great. Great. So uh, well, I guess uh, let me check on yours. Can I see him? Because your classmates are, are a little behind. So I think I'll check yours now. Okay. All right, so. Okay. Mm hmm. Yeah, new measures are being uh, created or issued. Uh, probably one and two have to change the verbs. The structure is okay, but the verbs are, um, the verbs have to be changed. Like three new measures, or uh, three new safety measures have been uh, issued or have been created Maybe that one, but la estructura está bien, solo el, el, el digamos, el significado, ¿verdad? Okay. Maybe Pero vocabulary. Dice que era expedir o publicar. Ajá, uh -huh. yeah, that's what issue means. But yeah, but how about the earplugs? The earplugs is like, aquí we have been created new earplugs. Ahí en, en, el, en, en esa, lo que pasa es que en la segunda no tiene, no pega. En la primera sí tiene el sentido issue, pero en la segunda, uh, earplugs, no mucho. No mucho, yeah. Mm -hmm. Yes. All right, so ahí eso quizás solo tienen que cambiar la posición de lo, del verbo. O sea, en la primera, quizás swap, you know, cambiar el, el, que, en el que está en el segundo por el primero. Ahí quizás tendría más sentido. Mm -hmm. Created uh, for 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 issued. Uh, All right. Mm -hmm. Yeah, like that, like that. Uh, yeah, just like that. Mm -hmm. Have been created and we have been issued, issued new earplugs. All right. Good. Good. That's better. Like it. All right. Great. I'll keep checking on the other groups. Okay. Thank you. Of genuine letter. Leather. 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 Le with homework <laughs> uh, about your homework uh has the has the new safety officer been trained that's okay uh number one is okay but i but the spelling created created ed only not created or whatever created mm -hmm. yeah uh, yeah, yeah, that one, but but the rest is okay. Okay. Okay, thank you. Yeah, creative.
cake. Yes. And the other one, teacher? Uh, number two is good. We have been given new earplugs. Uh, number three, new safety goggles are nice. Uh, they have been innovated. Yeah. Yeah, the steel boots is good. New steel toe, uh, toe boots have been made of genuine leather. That's good. Genuine, you say. Genuine leather. Genuine. Genuine. Yeah, genuine leather. And uh, uh, let's see. Has the new safety... Yeah, that's fine. Have we been issued new helmets? Yeah, that's good. They all are good. Very good job, girls. Well done. Well, I guess I guess we're going back to the to the main session. Okay. All right. Good. Thank you. Right, thank you. All right, great. How are you guys doing? Oopsie. Romulo, your light is on. <laughs> All right. Hey, great job. Don't worry. Great job. So uh, let's see. I think a few more people are still. Well, now this, this was it. Yeah, this was it. So. Let's uh, compare our sentences. So number one goes like this. Three new safety measures. Complete it, please, uh, Romulo. Number one goes like three new safety measures. Okay, the, the new safety measure have been created. All right, yeah, they have been created. That's good, that's what makes more sense. Very good. Let's continue with the next uh, number two. Number two, can you read it, uh, Aleda, please? Um, we have been issued. Mm -hmm. Issued, yeah. New All right, we've been issued new earplugs. That's good. All right, next one. Uh, number three, please. Uh, Omar, will you? Yes. Okay, go ahead, please. Okay, the new safety Google are nice. They have been innovated very good. So, have you been innovated your safety Google in your company? Uh huh. All right. Yeah, you made a question too. That's good. That's great. All right. Um, then a number. What number five? Okay, number. Wait, number four. Number four, uh, I want uh, Camilla to read it, please. Okay, the new steel toy box has been made of genuine leather. Genuine leather, yeah. All right, great. And uh, how about number five? Uh, let's see, Mary. Uh, has the new safety measures been trained? Trained, yes, good, thank you. And what about number six? Um, Aravela, what about number six? Okay, he's a uh, have we been issued the new helmet? Okay, great. Have we been issued the new helmets? Um, great, great, very good. So uh, here we're using the participle forms, and I'm I'm glad you guys uh, you guys got this at this point. Uh, that was a very good participation. Keep it up. Well done. Hey, now uh, we are going to <clears throat> uh, we're going to continue working with uh, with this. I have so many more exercises, and uh, we'll do a few practices. So. Uh, let's check on these on these ones that we have over here. All 
All right, great. So uh, please look at the screen and uh, and uh, help me answering these ones. So what about this? The results. Um, let's see, Camilla, can you read it? Okay, the result of the degree examination. Yes. Uh huh. What do you um, do you think you can complete it? The result of the degree examination has has not been announced. 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 All right. Yes. Have not been announced. That's good. Very good. Keep it up. Uh, next one, please. Uh, Jonathan. Okay. Um, the Aman, Ama, Ama, Anamik, Anamika. Say again. Anam, ah, sorry. Has she, has she funnel him? Has she found him? Okay, now uh, you are Re going to rewrite the sentences. Yeah, in passive form. What do you think is the correct way to do it? Has she been funnel? Is the number four? Has she been funnel by him? Mm, are you sure? Who is the uh, the the doer and who's the object of the action? No, no, it's a. Uh, has has he been has he been phoned by her? Aha! Uh -huh, there you go. Has he been found found by her? Very good. Very good. All right. Great. And uh, how about here, please? Uh, let's see, somebody else. Please, um, <clears throat> who do we ask? Anna Lillian, how about this one, please? Number three. Okay, Anna Mika mm -hmm. has been invited to attend the filmer Awards distribution fiction function, yes. Uh, has been right, has been invited. Uh -huh. Yeah, yes. okay, good, good. All right, all right, guys. Uh, you we will we'll continue with these ones too. All right, how about number four? Let's see, Aleda, can you make this one? Can you do this one, please? Hello? Hello. No, I can't, sorry. Okay. Can, can you, you're breaking up. Don't worry, don't worry. Somebody else will do it. You you will participate when you, later, okay? Don't worry. Uh, let's see. Romulo, can you do this one, please? Can you do number four? We can hear you. Uh huh. Okay. Okay. Right, now, now we can. There is. There's uh, there's something wrong with this sentence. What is, uh, which is supposed to be the sentence in present perfect, passive? Select the correct one, or uh. so, or tell me the reasons why is incorrect. The wrong auditorium have been entered by me. 
The auditorium have been entered by me. Mm, what seems to be the problem here? <laughs> yeah. You use the wrong form of member only. Mm. I think that the sentence is correct, teacher. No. You sure? Huh? Are you sure? Uh, yeah, enter is a no part past participle. Okay, okay, okay. It doesn't have a, a past participle. Fine. Yeah. That's good. And what else? That's one point. There are two things Use that are incorrect. Use your wrong form. Past or no? All right, that's one. It's it's past participle. The past participle, yeah, just like Romulo said, that's one incorrect Thank thing you. in there. What else? Oh, okay. That the auxiliary verb. Uh -huh. Which one? <laughs> it's both the auxiliary and the main verb uh, are incorrect. Being interrupted. Yeah, the. It you uh, yeah, yeah. have been. Remember, it's a it's a third person, right? It's a an it. All right. So yeah, teacher. Mm -hmm. I got you. All right. Thank you. So that's it. That's what is run. There are many run things in here, but that was those were the two more important. Jesus, there are none of this. That's great. All right. Um, Mary. Can you do this one, please? Okay, let me see. Give it a try. The last one. This one, the one on the screen. So that the last one you mean, right? Despise the transgression is reputation. Patient has 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 note has not. Uh huh. Been has not been harmed. All right, good. Has not been harmed. Great, very good. Well, next one I think is on uh, Omar. What about this one? Okay. Is is quit. Is quit. Galleta. Okay. Nearly 500 biscuit packets. Pa uh, packets, yes. Um, have been distributed. All right. Yeah, that's good. Have been distributed. Mm -hmm. Fine. Mm -hmm. Packets, it's in plural. Okay. Mm -hmm. Correct. That's in Pluto. Yes, sir. Sir, yes, sir. All right. I think I'm missing just a few more people. Arabella, this is yours. You have to make this sentence into passive form. You see it here in active form. Now you have to make it passive. How do you do that? Okay, moment, please. Miss Liz have not been contracted. Okay, measles. Yeah, good, good, good job. 
Measles have not been contracted by them. Yeah, I think it's the one. Yeah, measles. Measles is a is an illness. I think it's como sarampión, algo así. Yes. We're just we're okay. just missing a few more. All right. Great. Measles. Yeah, we call it measles. Uh, measles, not measles. Measles are the rockets. This is our Me measles. They measles. sound. Okay. Um, they, it's funny. They sound very similar, but but they're not the same. Hey, you guys, let's move on. Yeah, let's move on. Uh, so I guess we're. I'm gonna ask. Let me see. Hey, looks like everybody's participated so far. Oh yeah, Mary, Mary again, I guess. Mary, how about number eight? Can you do this? Um, number eight. Um, have been submit, submit the document all right, read read the whole thing. So you have to choose two words, the first and the one in the com in the comma. Ah, yeah, yeah, the yeah. Okay. Mm -hmm. Yes, yes, yes. Um, I think it's the last one. Uh -huh. um, All right. Or Good. read the whole thing. Read the whole thing. Okay. Have uh, the document been submitted already? Mm hmm. Yeah, have the documents been submitted? All right, submitted. 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 Okay. submitted. All right. Uh, we're just missing a few more. <clears throat> uh, Aleda, what about this one, please? Uh, Alida, are you okay? The, uh, she has she has problem with your in, with her in, internet. Oh, I right. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I imagine. Mm. Hey, don't worry, Alida. We'll we'll figure something out here. Oh yeah. Now let's see, Jonathan. What about this one, number nine, please? Has the patients patients yeah patients patients temper yeah, the temperature 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 has the patient's temperature been taken mm -hmm. good good yeah, it is a number two, two yeah great great and uh here we have a a singular right this right. is is for About the uh, possessive good jonathan well done romulo I guess uh, yours is the next and last Okay. Mm -hmm. Why has the minister treat been postponed? Why? Oh, what is wrong with this one? <laughs> it can be you correct. can you can run or not? Can you? Can you? Yeah, you can do. <laughs> you can do. <laughs> <laughs> I don't remember. I don't remember that word. <laughs> yeah, come on, I mean, you can do it. You can do it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> or you can say also that there is nothing wrong with it. That is a possibility too. That there is I, nothing wrong with it. But you look possible. at it carefully.
Uh -huh. And then that should be postponed. The auxiliary operator should be had. The sentence is correct. The sentence is correct, teacher. Aha, uh -huh. there you go. Great. Well done. The sentence is correct. Hi, Omar. <laughs> <laughs> The sentence is correct. Yeah, well done. There is nothing wrong with it. It was all good. So, yes. Well done, guys. Well done. All right. Uh, yeah, now let, let's continue with, uh, let's continue with uh, other, uh, just a few more, more practices here. We'll work with, uh, with uh, participles, I mean, with, with, passive voice, but in the, in the, they can be in different tenses, not only in, in the present perfect, right? Be advised, there can be sentences in different tenses, not only in present perfect, they can be in simple present, they can be in present continuous, they can be in any other form. So don't worry if you see something something slightly different. All right, good. So here we go. Let's play. All right. So how about this one? Mary, what do you think? The second. The second? Can you read the whole thing? Um. The light bulb was invaded by Edison. All right. Great, great. The light bulb was invented by, by Edison. Great job. All right, good. Next question. Jesus, what is it, boy? All right, next question. All right, so what's the correct answer in here? Uh, let's see, Camilla, I'll give you this one. I, I think what kind of music was played by Mozart? Mm -hmm. mm, that is right. That is right. Very good. Next is, uh... Omar, next is yours, please. Let me see. Uh, John Kennedy in Dallas, Texas. John Kennedy is, no, was assassinated in Dallas, Texas. Yeah, he was assassinated. The last one. That is it. That is it. Very good. We are still ahead. Good. Um, what do I ask? Romulo, how about this one? Romulo. Yeah, many plays were written by William Shakespeare. Okay, all right, good. That's the one, that's the one. All right, were written. Written, yeah. Good job, good job, all right. Fine, now let's continue with the next. Okay, what about this one, Jonathan? Can you do it? Yes, yes. Communism. Communism. Yeah, communism. Communism was introduced in China by Mao Zedong. Mao Zedong. Yeah, was introduced, you said, right? Yeah, communism was introduced.
All right, good. Next one. Okay. Uh, here, Maria, please. Okay. Napoleon was defended at the Battle of Waterloo. Yeah, yeah. Was uh, defeated. 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 Okay. Do you understand? Uh, yeah. Good. Do you understand defeated? No. Nope. No. Nope. Nope. Uh, defeated is like uh, when somebody loses a battle. When somebody. It, it dies or loses a battle. Mm -hmm. Like, uh, for example, uh, he lost a battle in Waterloo against the English, I think. Hmm? Yes. Or like, okay. for example, when a team, when a, when a soccer team loses a game. Uh -huh. Like Barcelona was defeated. Mm -hmm. ah, in the champions. Okay. Mm -hmm. Okay. Yeah. Okay. Thank you. All right. Hey, no, no hard feelings on Barcelonians. All right. Just, just an example. <laughs> hey, you guys. Uh, yeah. Just the last one. All right. Uh, well, let's see. Who do we ask? Let's see. Uh, I guess uh, Camila. What about this one? The second one, Mandela was in prison uh, oh. for 27 years. All right. Yeah, was imprisoned. He was imprisoned by, for 27 years. Jesus. All right. I think we have just uh, time for one more to go. And uh, Jonathan is going to do this one. Please, Jonathan, go ahead. Johnny, are you there? Yo. Mm -hmm. Yes. Sorry, sorry, sorry. That's okay. The theory of relativity uh, was proposed by Einstein. Was, was proposed. Was proposed. Very good. Very good. Now, uh, I think I'm going to stop this, uh, this activity right here for now. And uh, I'm gonna run attendance for the last time. And uh, and yes, just uh, just uh, just let's check on it. So it is Dorotea Sanchez Figueroa, no está. Claudia Evelyn Hernandez tampoco. Eh, a ver, Shane Zohar Deming tampoco. Mario Enrique, Marquez Celaya, no está. A ver. E Andrea Elizabeth Singwenza Mejia. Okay, good job, guys. Uh, thank you for staying. Thank you for staying. And uh, uh, just a uh, little advice for tomorrow, please be on time. We are running attendance tries, and uh, it's not only this. So we we have like three attendance controls in, in total. En total tenemos como tres o cuatro controles de asistencia. O sea, tenemos los tres que nosotros tomamos. Y al ustedes loguearse en Zoom, automáticamente, auto, automáticamente eh, Zoom toma el registro del tiempo al que usted se logueó. Eso lo registra corporativo y lo compara con la asistencia que nosotros como teachers tomamos. Y a eso le sacan los minutos tarde. ¿Ok? So it's not just uh, it's not just uh, same present at nine. Y de ahí me voy y regreso después o vengo solo a las nueve a pasar la asistencia. Careful, careful, because uh, we've been monitoring so many ways. So so you, you be careful with this. Now, just one question. I have to do I have to do like uh, reinforcement sessions. Tengo que hacer sesiones de refuerzo estos últimos días de la semana, 10 minutos extra. Si usted vino tarde y le costó este tema, 
puede quedarse. Vamos a repasar unos, unos 8 o 9 minutos más. Si usted, digamos, siente que todavía le está costando un poco passive voice, vamos a repasar este tema ahorita en estos minutos. If you want to, you can stay. Especially if you were here late and you're having trouble. All right? If not, you can leave. Okay, teacher. Thank you. All right. Welcome. Is anybody, is anybody going to stay? Okay. I'm sorry. I can't leave. Okay. All right. Okay. Yeah, that's fine. Good night. All right. Have a good night. Have a good Have night. Good night. Thank you. All right. Good I'll night. see you see tomorrow. You. Anna Lillian, are you tomorrow. want to stay? Yes, teacher. Thank okay. you. Okay. Great. Great. No problem. All right. Great. Entonces, vamos, let, let's, uh, let's go ahead and uh, review. Let's go ahead and review uh, passive voice. So, we are going to, we're, mainly we're going to practice. Um, the same play, teacher. It's very funny. <laughs> the same game. Yeah, yeah. Let, we, we will do the same game. First, uh, I'll do some, uh, vamos a repasar como la... Vamos a repasar la forma, o sea, vamos a repasar la estructura y ya cuando tengamos los, los, uh, la estructura, vamos a hacer el, eh, vamos a hacer el, vamos a hacer uno de esos ejercicios, ¿ok? Ok. All right. First, uh, let's just review structure, all right? Let us review structure and uh, let's, let me share my screen. So, to make... Uh, passive voice in the present perfect, all we do is this. Can you read it? Can you read it, uh, Ana Lilian? Okay. What do we have to do? Please. Okay. In the present perfect tense, we make passive verb forms by putting has, have, blessed been, before, past pers participle from on the verb. Sentence are given in the active voice. Change the into the passive. All right, so we're gonna change these sentences into passive. So you see, has been right in has the, the participle. Great. So I have finished the job. Uh, what do you think is the correct form for this one? The job. Has been finished. All right, good. The job has been finished. Mm -hmm. All right, good. And how about this one, Aleida? Can you hear? Uh, can you participate? Mm -hmm. The cat has drunk the milk. Mm -hmm. The milk um, has been drunk by the cat. The milk has been drunk by the cat. Like it. Hey, what about number three, uh, Anna Lillian? Can you do that one? Okay. The girls have product producer the flowers. Uh -huh. The flowers. Yeah. Have uh, have been plucked. All right. The the, yeah, that was good. It was correct. Plucked. Plucked is como jalar o sacar así a la fuerza. Um, okay. Mm -hmm. Good. Uh, please. Uh, Aleda, next one, please. I have watched that movie. Mm -hmm. That movie has been watched by me. All right. Good. It has been watched by me. That's good. And uh, Annalena, here is uh, yours. Number five. Okay. Peter has broken another window. Another window has been broken by Peter. All right, good. Good, like it. All right, what about uh, next, this one, uh, Aleda? I have written six letters. Six letters has been written by me. All right, good. Ha six letters has been or have been? Um, has been. You sure? Plural. Think about plural, please. Mm, have been. Mm -hmm. Have been. Okay, great. Have been. It's plural. 
that's and that's a good point it's plural uh please and lillian continue okay. with this one yes have you received the person um has the person been received by you all right has the parcel okay uh -huh. good good very good next one uh alida you please uh the as or accept accepted accepting the invitation has the invitation as has the invitation been accepted aha uh -huh. there you go great and Lillian, this is yours. I have known her for a long time. Mm -hmm. She has been known to me for a long time. All right, she has been known. Okay, good. Well, how many of these are there? Jesus. All right, uh, we'll <laughs> just do 10. All right, then we, I will give you an, uh, a different practice. Okay. All right, uh, please, Alida. Our team has won the championship. The championship uh, has been won. Has been won. By... Yeah, sorry, sorry. That's good. <laughs> Don't worry. Don't worry. That's good. Okay, now I want you to think before we go, I want you to think about something that has happened recently in our country. Like anything from the news, like pro probably, uh, probably a person that was killed or somebody that was robbed or uh, a new song that has been released, an accident that, that, that happened and make a sentence in the passive voice as if it was uh, as if it was uh, a newspaper's heading. Como que fuera el, el encabezado de un, de un, de un, uh, del periódico. Mm -hmm. So, may, you know, come up with an idea like that. All right. So, like, for example, oh, two men were killed, or ah, two people were ran over, or two people were sent to the hospital after blah, blah, blah. Come up. This, it's, this is how I see your creativity and how I can tell that, yes, you can use it. Exercises are like, yeah, A, B, that's fine. But your creativity is the real test. Mm, The school year has been difficult. Oh, all right, has been. And now, please, please, use a uh, participle. The school year has been. Come on, um, a verb in participle. It's been cuter. Has been <laughs> what? Um. Um. Has been um, uh, difficult. Uh, no, no, no. Uh, use a verb, a verb. impossible. Uh -huh. A verb impossible. But you're good. That's a good start. The school year. Yeah, come on, you can do cut. it. Say again. Cut. Cut. Okay. Cut. No. no, no. no. Um, Hard. Hard, you mean? No, let's use a verb. Let's use a verb, como un, un verbo. Uh, Lo ponen participio. Like, for example, has been canceled, has been, has been paused, has been stopped. I don't know, it, but it has to be a verb. You, you think about it. And uh, Ana Lilian, any idea of a newspaper heading? Um, 
Uh, I'm looking for ideas. Oh, come on. Uh, um, um, has been, um, we have to use has been in a verb. Yes, verb. Mm -hmm. Or have or has. Mm -hmm. Has been eaten? No. Mm -hmm. How about the, the coronavirus uh, vaccine? The coronavirus vaccine? Come on, come on, come on. Has been created. Yeah, has been created by? By, by Russia. Russia. Yeah, by Russia. Yeah, there you go. Good. <laughs> Good. There you go. So yeah, look 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 at the difference between using like a yeah, one uh -huh. ABC and so on and then ooh make a sentence. That's more difficult. Uh -huh. All right. Mm -hmm. But but we'll come we'll continue trying and practicing. All right. Thank you so very much for staying girls. Uh I hope to see you tomorrow. Please try to make it on time. All right. I know we have yeah. trouble and, and all, but let, let's try to make it on time, okay? You have a good night. Thank you, teacher. Bye. Thank you very Thank much you. for Goodbye. your time, too, okay? Uh, I think Thank you. you much. All right. Bye, Alayda. Good night. Good night. Bye. Good night.